In this quick guide, we point out several tips and techniques for improving your chances of passing a mouth swab drug test, even if you've smoked weed within the past 24 hours. Fortunately, mouth swab drug tests are one of the easiest drug tests to pass, as detectable THC rarely stays in the saliva for more than 48 hours. If you can plan for an oral swab in advance, try to abstain from smoking weed for 72 hours before the test. In most instances, this should be more than enough to ensure you pass with flying colors. Of course, most problems occur when you don't have time to plan for the test and are subject to an oral swab with little to no notice. Hopefully, that's where we can come in to try and help. It might seem obvious, but one of the most important things you can do to prepare for a mouth swab test is to practice immaculate oral hygiene. We're talking vigorously brushing your teeth up to half a dozen times a day and making sure to include all the spots that you normally might overlook, such as the cheeks, gums, and tongue. And of course, using mouthwash religiously in the hours and days leading up to the test can work wonders as well. Another trick is to chew as much ice as possible in the time leading up to the mouth swab. The ice will not only keep you hydrated, but will also dilute the THC content to, hopefully, non-detectable levels. Unless you're an avid fitness nut or health freak, you can also try eating the oiliest and fattiest foods possible leading up to the drug test. THC is fat-soluble, which means the more oils and fats you put into your mouth, the more the compound will get absorbed and transferred into your gut, rather than your mouth. Some fatty foods that might help do the trick are things like butter, coconut oil, olive oil, cheese, avocados, and ultra-oily fish like mackerel or sardines. You can even try mixing some coconut oil, red palm oil, and butter into a hot cup of tea or coffee for an ultra-fatty beverage that will help mop up the active THC in your saliva. If you're really pressed for time though, and only have a matter of hours before your mouth swab test, your best option is probably trying to adulterate your saliva. This may sound a little intense or dangerous, but it really just means swishing and gargling your mouth out with a couple tablespoons of hydrogen peroxide. Just make sure not to swallow any. In fact, there are companies who make packets of chewing gum that are infused with hydrogen peroxide for this exact purpose. A great option to have around if roadside drug tests are common in your state, or if your employer likes to spring unexpected oral swabs on you. If you do decide to go the hydrogen peroxide route though, try and gargle about half an hour before your swab, as this should allow for optimal saliva adulteration and maximum THC reduction. Lastly, if you absolutely have no other alternative, you may try something as simple as swishing and gargling Gatorade or cranberry juice, then chewing on ice for the remainder of the time leading up to the test. This is by no means a guaranteed option, but it's certainly better than nothing if you're in a pinch. Of course, be advised that if you choose to employ any of these tips or tricks, you're doing so entirely at your own discretion. We're not responsible for any hazards, infractions, or complications that might arise from trying to pass a mouth swab drug test with little to no notice. If you have any first-hand experience with mouth swab drug tests, feel free to post your thoughts in the comment section below. Good luck!